Exciting news. Google has recently launched its advanced AI chatbot, Gemini, a game changer in the world of AI. This impressive model surpasses ChatGPT4 in various aspects, opening doors to a new era of creative possibilities and in-depth understanding. In this video, we'll explain what is Google Gemini AI, what are the differences between Gemini and ChatGPT4, and how to use Gemini on BARD. What is Google Gemini AI? Gemini is a cutting-edge AI model developed by Google AI and currently powering BARD. This large language model, LLM, boasts a range of impressive capabilities, including multimodal learning, seamlessly processes information from various formats like text, code, and even images, enabling it to tackle complex tasks requiring diverse data sources. Advanced reasoning exhibits powerful logic and reasoning abilities, allowing it to solve problems, draw inferences, and reach conclusions based on the given information. Flexibility and adaptability adapts to various contexts and situations, making it versatile and applicable to a wide range of tasks. High-quality generation generates various creative text formats like poems, code, scripts, musical pieces, emails, and letters with accuracy and fluency. Continuous learning and evolution constantly learns and evolves thanks to its advanced architecture and Google Eye's ongoing research efforts, ensuring its capabilities and performance continuously improve. Gemini vs. ChatGPT4 Unveiling the Differences Both Gemini and ChatGPT4 are cutting-edge LLMs, but key differences set them apart. Architecture and Training Data Gemini, built on Google's Palm architecture and trained on a massive data set of text and code, including GitHub repositories. ChatGPT4, built on OpenAI's GPT-4 architecture and trained on text and code including books, Wikipedia articles, and public GitHub repositories. Strengths, Gemini, multimodal learning, handles information from diverse formats like text, code, and images. Advanced logic and reasoning, tackles complex tasks requiring problem solving and inference. Efficient, runs efficiently on various devices, including smartphones, free access, currently available for free public use. ChatGPT4, creative text generation, renowned for producing highly creative and engaging text formats. Accessibility, available through various APIs and commercial platforms. Weaknesses, Gemini, limited public information, less information available about its inner workings compared to ChatGPT4. Newer technology, still under development compared to ChatGPT4, which has been available for a longer period. ChatGPT4, limited factual accuracy, may sometimes generate factually inaccurate text, limited multimodal capabilities, less adept at handling information from diverse formats. Costly, access to advanced features requires paid subscriptions. Unlocking the power of Gemini on BARD, ready to unleash Gemini's potential. Here's how to use it on BARD. Step 1. On your Android phone or tablet, go to BARD.Google.com. Step 2. If you're not already signed in, sign into your Google account. Learn how to sign in. Step 3. In the text box at the bottom, enter your question or prompt. Step 4. Optionally, to add a photo to your prompt, tap Upload Image. Remember these tips for optimal results with Gemini. Use clear and concise language. Avoid jargon or technical terms. Break down your request into smaller steps. This facilitates understanding and desired output. Provide examples. Help Gemini understand your preferences for more accurate results. Be patient and experiment. Explore different prompts and settings to find the best fit. The arrival of Google Gemini AI marks a significant leap forward in the realm of AI. Its groundbreaking multimodal approach and unmatched computing power set a new benchmark for AI capabilities. As we move forward, the full potential and wider. If you have any more Google Gemini AI discussions and questions, please leave a comment in our comments section and don't forget to like and subscribe. Thanks for watching.